Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I thought that I would do a really subtle, simple, back to school makeup tutorial. Because in the UK, by the time this video goes up, kids will start going back to school and stuff. So I thought why not film a back to school makeup tutorial. So obviously I'm not in school anymore, but when I was in school, makeup was kind of frowned upon in school and not many people wore a lot of makeup and I certainly didn't wear loads of makeup in school because I knew that if I did I'd have to go and wash it off in the bathroom because I saw some girls having to wash their makeup off after being told off. So I just pretty much wore foundation and mascara and maybe a little bit of eyeliner. So I don't know what it's like in schools nowadays but when I was there you couldn't wear a lot of makeup. So today I'm going to do a really simple natural looking makeup tutorial for you guys going back to school. By the way, excuse my voice, <clears throat> I don't know what's going on but the last couple of days I've had like a sore throat and a bad cough so I'm really sorry if I sound like really weird. So yeah, just put that out there. Okay so to start with I am going to prime my face using the NYX Angel Veil Primer. So I'm going to apply this over my face. Okay, and then as my base, I'm thinking not to use foundation today. I think I'm going to use concealer all over my face, but I can't decide which concealer to use. I think I might mix these two, because I think that this one's too dark, and I think that this one's a bit too light. Mm, so I might mix the two. Yeah, I'm going to mix the two. So I'm going to use the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in, I think it's number 10 and the Collection Last Imperfection Concealer in Fair. So I'm going to mix these together. Oh, by the way, I'm using the Real Techniques Buffing Brush. Forgot to mention. I think concealer is a really like subtle way of going natural with makeup because if you don't want too much makeup on, then concealer is a great alternative to foundation, and it does the job just as well, to be honest. Right now, I'm just going to apply some below my eyes I'm going to apply some above my eyes too just because I have veiny eyelids so just to get rid of that and to blend this one in I'm going to use the Real Techniques Miracle Complexion Sponge And I'm just going to conceal up um, the red areas, the spots, I have some on my forehead and up here. I'm just going to conceal those. Okay, so that's the base done. Now I'm going to set my whole face using the MUA translucent pressed powder. Right, now I'm going to use the NYX Control Freak Clear Eyebrow Gel just to keep my eyebrows in place. Obviously I'm not going to fill them in or anything. Um, if you guys really want to fill in your eyebrows for school then go ahead but I just don't fill my eyebrows in anyway and I guess for school the more natural the better. So I just put a clear eyebrow gel just to keep my eyebrows in place all day. 
Okay, so I've zoomed you in now because I'm going to apply a little bit of eyeshadow. So I'm just going to take the NYX Natural Eyeshadow Palette and I'm just going to take the colour here. And I'm going to take the Real Techniques Deluxe Crease Brush and I'm just going to apply this to my crease. We're not going to do anything too, like, outrageous for school. I just want a little bit of colour. Then I'm just going to take this warmer shade here and I'm going to take the Base Shadow Brush by Real Techniques. I'm just going to apply this to the outer corners. And then I'm just going to take the same brush and this colour here and I'm going to highlight my brow bone and I'm just going to take this into the onto the lid and the inner corners of my eyes. So then I'm just going to apply a little bit of eyeliner and I'm going to use the NYX Slide On, Glide On, Stay On and definitely a Turn On waterproof extreme shine eyeliner I don't know what they were thinking when they named this and this is in what shade is this let's have a look what shade is this this is in brown perfection so I'm just going to tight line with this and then I'm just going to take my number seven eyelash curlers Curl my lashes. And then I'm going to take the Rimmel London Super Volume and Curl Mascara. And this is in the shade Black. I'm just going to apply this to my upper and lower lashes. And then I'm just going to finish with a really subtle lip gloss. This is the NYX Butter Gloss in Fortune Cookie. And this is a really subtle nude glossy kind of lipstick. And there we have it, a really quick and simple and easy back to school makeup tutorial. I don't think you'd have a problem with wearing this kind of makeup in school. I would wear this in school. It's not too um, bold. There's not heavy makeup on so I think that this would be perfect for back to school. I mean you don't have to put eyeshadow on, you don't have to put eyeliner on, you don't have to do anything that I've said really. It's totally up to you. This is what I would wear if I was going back to school. So yeah you can take my advice on board if you want to or you could change something. To work with whatever makeup you have so I hope you liked this video if you did can you please give it a big thumbs up down below let me know if you've um, tried this makeup tutorial if you're gonna wear it to school um, let me know that in the comments remember to subscribe to my channel if you're not already so that you can see my next video thanks for watching guys see you all soon bye